at Dollar Tree. I bought these Scooby-Doo Sour Straws. Um, they're uh, assorted fruit flavors is what it says. And then I bought these Peanuts Sour Gummies. And they're actually by Bobito. And um, it looks like I have all the, the colors in there. Um, and then for Kevin's Lunchtime Review Channel, he has tried a lot of these fast bite sandwiches before, but today they had the classic hot dog and the chili cheese dog, and he might review both of those in one video. But then I saw these, um, and I've never seen these before. These are tombstone, like tombstone pizza. This is a triple cheese sticks and the pepperoni pizza sticks. And then they had this uh, Hot Pockets brand, Sweet Treats Cinnamon Roll. So, you never know, he may combine the Sweet Treats Cinnamon Roll with these in one video, I don't know. I don't know how he'll do that, but that looks like they're all the same shape, and that looks like it would be a good dessert to have after one of these. So I don't know how he'll do it, but that'll be on his Lunchtime Review channel. At Walmart, I bought some Starkist tuna in water. I just bought two of them. I bought some sweetener and creamer for coffee. Uh, Kevin, um, I've been wanting him to try Pete's coffee. I've heard about it for years. We've never had it. This is just the medium roast coffee. I bought three of the uh, Nature Valley Crunchy peanut butter bars. Uh, I bought a package of Payday candy bars and a package of Snickers candy bars. The Land O'Lakes butter that we buy is finally back. I have been looking for this for literally a month. This is the kind I like to buy because it's a light and it does make a difference in calories. It's only 50 calories per tablespoon. So if you're wondering how that much that how that compares to yours, the kind you buy, go look in your refrigerator because 50 calories for a tablespoon is really good. So, uh, but they have changed the packaging. Um, I bought the Kinds. Uh, kind Healthy Grains Peanut Butter Whole Grain Clusters, which I will have with the Dan and Light and Fit Original Greek Vanilla Yogurt. I bought this for Andrew for when he comes over. He likes these Great Value Wild Strawberry uh, drink packets. They're powders, and uh, so I don't know how many he has, but I'm sure he's getting low. Um, I bought a dozen eggs, some uh, two bags of uh, Lay's Classic Potato Chips. These are uh, single bags. And then I bought two Quilted Northern uh, toilet papers. They didn't have, normally we would buy one big package. They didn't have one big package, so I bought two smaller ones. We bought two of the Nestle Pure Life Waters. Each one of them has 32 bottles. And then I bought these uh, Clorox toilet wand refills. At Meyer, I bought a loaf of bread. Um, I bought these new Sunmade Bites. They had s'mores, birthday cake, PB&J, and Banana Split. Uh, they also had Nature Valley Packed Bars. These are sustained energy bars. This one is uh, creamy peanut butter, crunchy nuts and seeds, and uh, chewy cranberries. And then this one is almond butter, crunchy nuts and seeds, and blueberries. They also had um, some caveman bars. I think these have been out for a while, but we haven't tried them. We've tried caveman bars a long time ago, and they were really good, so... I wanted to try these. This is the coconut cashew granola bar and the blueberry almond granola bar. Uh, we need some more nature seasoning. Uh, then up at the bakery, they had this um, sandwich cookie. It's a chocolate chip sandwich cookie, and I just thought it looked really good, so I figured we would try it. And then they had these upper crust bakery uh, lemon bites, celebration bites, and double chocolate bites. And then I bought, let me see what this name is. This is Taylor Grace Cookies. This is the chocolate and vanilla cookie cakes, buttercream and fudge frosting, birthday cookie cakes, vanilla buttercream frosting. These are lemon cookie cakes with lemon frosting. And then on the bottom are chocolate cherry cookie cakes. Uh, delicious cherry frosting, that just sounds wonderful. And then I bought these Loft House uh, cookies. These are crackle lemon cookies and I had never seen those before. At Big Lots, uh, we found these Lambert's soft baked cookies. These are lemon and strawberry. Those are the only ones we saw. Then they also, I bought a, a box of candy cigarettes. Well, it's Chris, they're candy sticks. Oh. 
Oh, well, okay. <laughs> but they're candy cigarettes. They're cigarettes, okay. And then I bought these um, Swiss rolls. This is the tiramisu and the cocoa. And then these look really good. Uh, these look like something like Mr. Kipling cakes. Uh, and you'll see, I'm trying to say, they're made in Spain. Dulce so, Sol? That sounds good. Yeah. <laughs> uh, this is a tiramisu. This is angel cake. Hazelnut cake. And cheesecake. And those just look, especially these, they remind me of the Mr. Kipling angel slices. Mm -hmm. That's what they look like. Um, then at five below, we bought these Jimmy, um, these are a clean protein bars. Uh, they, we have the chocolate peanut butter, the cookies and cream, and the birthday bash. We found some hers, Carolina Reaper, uh, scorch and hot cheese curls, and some hers, uh, cheese fries. Um, at CVS, I bought the Vortman Bakery Raspberry Lemonade Wafers. If you follow me on Instagram, I also posted a picture. They have the s'mores um, out for a limited edition, but we've already reviewed the s'mores. Uh, I also bought the Flips Mix. It has pretzels, chocolate, popcorn, candy. Um, then at Aldi, we bought these pita chips. These are the uh, caramelized onion and balsamic vinegar and the gorgonzola. Uh, pita chips. Uh, we found the uh, chocolate peanut butter uh, Reese's uh, uh, cookies. They do have a, um, this is the chocolate version. They do have a, like a regular version, but our Aldi was out of them. Uh, but I did buy these uh, bake shop uh, cookies, which I thought looked really good. They're chocolate chip, just like the one that I showed you earlier. And then at Ollie's, Ollie's had these, uh, this planter's uh, peanut butter and we've never reviewed planters peanut butter. They had the creamy and the crunchy and then we found more hers that we have not tried. The uh, creamy ranch and habanero which um, five below also had these. Um, the hers hot cheese flavored popcorn and then this is the uh, fire roasted sweet corn and then we found the uh, Dippin' Dots cookies and cream. At Kroger, we've got some private selection sourdough extra large sandwich buns. We got a big thing of chicken breast. Uh, we wanted something smaller, but they just had this big one. Yeah, I really only needed like four at max. Yeah, and this is five, but they're very large, especially these. Uh, then we bought some uh, private selection shaved Parmesan cheese, uh, two of the Tillamook mozzarella cheeses, uh, some leaf oregano, uh, traditional panko breadcrumbs. This is the private selection brand. I um, actually picked out some salt and pepper shakers. These, they have like a new display and I'll show you some other things from that display. These were only three dollars and they had these and a green color one that was really pretty. Uh, she bought some light, lighter flavor olive oil, some Prego traditional uh, spaghetti sauce, some balsamic vinegar, um, this was on that display that we bought the uh, salt and pepper shaker on. This is, uh, these are paper clips. And then she bought these erasers. She has a, um, a prize box for her kids. So she bought these erasers and then these were in there. And I'm thinking these were like a dollar a piece. And then she bought some cars. And then she bought some pine nuts. And I saw these. They say new. I don't know how long they've been out. They're uh, King Arthur flour, gluten-free. Uh, it's a chocolate chip cookie. And then this one is a super fudge brownie, which sounds really good. And then I actually bought three packages of uh, basil or basil. And then uh, I bought two of the Dan and Light and Fit uh, vanilla Greek yogurts. At our local Shell station, I found these Uncle Ray's pork rinds. These are the, uh, they're all country style fried. Uh, these, I don't, I don't know what the difference, one of them's just pork rinds, one of them's barbecue, and one of them's hot. So, I didn't see a name on those green ones, but that's, I guess those are just regular pork rinds. And then I found this popsicle. This is a SpongeBob SquarePants, but this is fruit punch and cotton candy. And that's why I bought it, because I thought, Cotton candy, that sounds really good. And then I found this Good Humor, this is an Oreo cone. And I remember trying the Good Humor Oreo bars, but not an Oreo cone. 